Hello everyone and welcome back to another Neopets Dailies with Toast. I hope you have had a wonderful week. Um, I can't believe that we have NCUCs coming out um, tomorrow. I'm so shocked. Well, I mean, I guess, yeah, tomorrow because it's officially the 22nd in Neopia and Neopets is going to be going down for maintenance tonight at 11 p.m. Neopian Standard Time um, until tomorrow the 23rd, I think at like 3 a.m. Neopian Time. So make sure you get your dailies, okay? I'm going to try to upload this early so that y'all know to get your dailies done as soon as possible. You don't want to wait till the last minute and miss a day and miss your weekly prize or have that reset on you, okay? So make sure you go out there and you're doing your dailies um, and, you know, that you don't miss nothing, all right? So um, there still has been no plot update, but, I mean, the hype has still been there because of the whole NCUC situation going on. I mean... Um, they're releasing not only Fairy, which they announced previously, but they're also going to be releasing Gray and Derrigan. So I'm super stoked. I am definitely going to have to buy a bit of the NCUC tokens. Um, I mean, there's been a lot of controversy around it, and mostly that controversy is because they're going to be converting all previous NC, I'm sorry, some previous UCs. They're going to be converting all of them. And um, from what I understand, they're going to be giving all of the UCs that are out right now, um, that they're going to be giving them a trophy to like signify that this was like an OG UC or whatever. And then, um, that's 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 going to be it. All of the pets are going to be converted. Um, now, all of the UCs that are out right now are going to be given a token for um, whatever color and species that pet currently is so that it can stay a UC. Even though it's technically converted, it still has the quote-unquote skin um, of a UC, okay, with the NC item. So, I mean, there's really not going to be a distinguishing way between what's an original UC and what isn't, other than that little trophy, um, but there's not going to be a way, to, like, they're not going to look different. So, that's one of the things that's been causing a stir up. I personally um, don't care. I mean, I feel uh, bad, I guess, if, you know, it, okay, like, I was, I was not, I was not active, but I was already on Neopets when the original conversion happened, and um, I remember the chaos that ensued. I remember I wasn't happy. I was like, I don't like the converted pets at all. Like, I don't want this. Um, and nobody had a say. It was just you were converted, period. And then some special pets that, like, didn't get converted, you had the option to opt into conversion or not. But once you opted into conversion, that was the end of the story. You couldn't opt back. So some I can understand the feelings. Um, some people not wanting to go pressured into the conversion. Uh, you know, but at the end of the day... It's leveling the playing field. So everybody's going to have a converted pet. And then in order to have an unconverted pet, you need the UC NC item. Okay. So that I can get behind. Uh, like the fact that you can have a UC that was created tomorrow, right? You can have a UC that was created today or yesterday, right? That's great, in my opinion, okay? Because I love the UC art, and I do not have the patience or skill or capability or care to trade up for a UC. Like, I, I ain't nobody got time for that, all right? I mean, props to you if you were into the 
you see trading, but that was not that was not me. Okay, I like pet trading; it's fun, but I'm I'm not about that life. Okay, is it was intimidating and it felt very exclusionist. Now, that being said, one of the parts that I did have a little bit of a I don't feel like gripe is the right word, but I wasn't originally happy to hear was that the NCUCs are going to be specifically, um, they're going to be items specific for the species and specific for the color. Okay. So if you buy, right, um, for instance, okay, Tinkerbell, my fairy Drake, okay, she's a converted fairy Drake. She could be a UC fairy drake, right? Because they're releasing the NCUC fairy tokens and the other two, Derek and Gray, tomorrow. Okay. Because she is fairy already, uh, it doesn't matter. Like, I could buy a fairy NC drake token or whatever they are exactly um, and use it on her and it will make her an a UC fairy drake. Now, I could use that same token. So like I could put that on, let's say Starry New, which is a candy drake. I could put that same token because she is a drake. Even though she's not fairy, she could be a fairy you see. Okay. So what that means is that you do not have to have your drake painted the color to make it a UC of that color. The token is enough, right? So I wasn't super happy about that because I'm like, well, what's the point of buying the paintbrushes? You know, yeah, you can make your uh, not UC that color, right? You can make your um, converted pet a fairy converted drake, right? So if I use that token, for instance, on Tinkerbell, and then I decided to take it off because I wanted to customize her, she'd still be fairy, right? Versus I'm assuming, I'm assuming, okay, because we won't know for sure until it's confirmed. Um, but if I were to put that on Starry New and I took it off, she would still be candy, not fairy, right? Does that make sense? Okay. So I was originally a little, like, peeved about that, but then I started thinking about it, like... You know, it feels like they're doing too much, right? Because that means that they're going to have, for every single species that is available in the colors Fairy, Grey, and Derrigan, they're going to have a token for every single pet in all of those colors. And I'm like, that just feels like way too freaking much. I was under the impression that it was going to be one token item, okay, for fairy one token item for gray and one token item for derrigan right and then you put them on your pet and that is already that color and bam they've got the uc skin but i started thinking about it and i'm like okay it probably has something to do with the spaghetti code that neopets is and they probably like literally couldn't do it that way without rewiring something Okay, I'm not going to pretend to know how coding works, all right? I know a little bit of HTML, a little bit of CSS, but, like, I, no, nah, I, that's, I, I used to play around building websites back when you could just get away with HTML and CSS, because that's all there was, and, like, some JavaScript, but, like, that was, what, like, 20 years ago, okay? So, like, I don't, I'm not even going to pretend to know how Neopets is coded, and so, I'm assuming that they had to do it that way because it's almost, you know, the, the, that's how it makes sense to Neopets. I know I'm rambling. I should be doing dailies, but I wanted to touch on this topic because it's very hot right now and it's, you know, important, right, to the Neopets community. So that being said, um, I I guess I'm not as mad as I was. Um, you know, they said that the... Um, you know, part of the reason why they're doing it, like, that you don't have to paint the pets that color is so that 
the paintbrushes don't get uh you know scalped which they are already starting to get you know super expensive you know inflated um but like really it's just going to pass the buck on to something else okay so earlier last week um as an example the pirate drake morphing potions were the cheapest drake morphing potions at like 250 270,000 neo points okay when I checked the other day, they were like, like 700 or something like that, right? So like, potions. Um, I know I could probably just check this on Jelly Neo and it would show like the history. Look at that. They're not even Bible. Oh, wait. Okay. I typed it wrong. Hold on. I put S at the end. I was like, they're not even Bible. Okay. 600K. Okay. So maybe not 700K. But 600k, that's still a lot, okay? Um, this is already starting to get pretty inflated when they were 200 and something a few days ago, okay? So other things are getting inflated. Is this as bad as like a 14 million Neopoint gray paintbrush? No, obviously not, you know, but in my opinion, <laughs> that nobody asked for if they really wanted to combat inflation on these paintbrushes, they could have just added them to the hidden tower. I still think that they should add some of these paintbrushes to the hidden tower. Specifically, like, why is the fairy paintbrush not in the hidden tower? It's a freaking fairyland. You would think that the fairy paintbrush would have been the first one in the hidden tower. It makes no sense to me that it's not in there, okay? I digress. Um, but yeah, so I'm, I was mad the first day about the whole, you don't paintbrush. I was like, what, what the fuck am I going to buy for my pets now? If I'm not going to buy them, you know, paintbrushes and like customize them. Well, I can spend the Neo points on actually customizing the not, uh, you see pets or the pets that I, yeah. right. Or like the NC you know, like, I'm still going to buy them backgrounds and stuff. Like, I could focus on getting my pet pets customized and, you know, right for all my pets and stuff. Um, you know, like, there's other things I guess I could spend my Neo points on. And I could still buy the paintbrushes just to not make them UC, just to make them match whatever I want them to be, right? Like, um, you know, even if they were, for instance, to release an uh, NCUC for... Uh, the mutant Aisha. I'm probably not going to buy that. Like, I like customizing my mutant Aisha. I think she's great. And speaking of which, I got her um, the sparkly paint thing for the mutants, and I made her even more purple because why the why not? Right? Why not? Um, I I did. I was like, I'm not going to spend any of my NC. Um, until the NCUCs come out and then they had this weekend sale and I was like, I need this bag. <laughs> I was like, I need this bag. And then I was like, I need this sparkly thing. And then I also bought some, uh, baby eyes that nobody's wearing. I just wanted them. So yeah, I spent some of my NC that I got in the other day and yeah. So hopefully the NCUCs aren't that expensive because I really do need a few of them like there's quite a few um that I'm already planning to buy right off the bat anyway I feel like I've gone on way too long about these NCUC stuff and um it's exciting but let's get let's get rolling into our dailies right like let's go let's go so first things first let's go ahead and hit up Trudy's and get some money from Trudy yes please hello babes Trudy what do you got for us today I don't think I have anything going on also by the way that they um updated the prize pool in Trudy's I'm not getting a prize today I know that but like they updated it and let me tell you it's nice to have some new stuff okay it's nice to not get the same thing over and over again for months and months okay but um i know everybody's been hoping 
that they <laughs> refresh the quest log, but wait until I get my Perigodoni. Wait until I get my Sildrake. Wait until I get my regular Kadoti and wait until I get my, like, freaking... Let me get, like, 16 more Crocs, please. Okay? You can update. You can update the prizes, but, like, let me, let me get more Crocs, okay? I need well, at least one Croc Pet Pet for every color Pet Pet Croc there is available because I want a Croc Gallery. And then let me get one more on top of that of each color because why not okay that's how many croc pet pets i want all right i'm gonna be a greedy croc pet pet hoarder but yeah anyway um so what do we got to do today we got to purchase an item spin the wheel of excitement we gotta play a game and feed a pet and customize a pet so let's go ahead and hit up those healing spring and we'll get something here okay and gain three hit points all right thanks for nothing babe i don't need it anyway that's all fine all right so we did that we only had to buy one item perfect so then now we got to go back to fairyland and it's been that wheel of excitement you know i'm really hoping that fairyland gets uh resurgence because i want to see fairyland back in the sky you know the fairies destruction and all that like we need some closure i hope that this uh new plot that we got coming in gives us a little bit of closure and then we can see fairyland rise back into the sky again like why did it have to fall permanently i don't get it like we need to put it back up there and then open the rainbow fountain for like a week right am i right am i right i'm right of course i'm right all right let's spin this wheel Oh, nothing. Speaking of updates, they need to update the Wheel of Excitement. I know I said this in my last video, but, like, they need to update all the wheels, okay? Because, like, what is this crap? It should be, it should be exciting. It should be, it should be 25,000. It should be 200,000. It should be 4,000, right? Like, add a zero to every single one of these numbers and then give us a bunch of different, like... Morphing potions and a fairy paintbrush to fall out of this. And, you know, maybe like a fairy fountain dip out of one of these. Like, give us some good stuff, girl. Come on. Okay. Next, we're going to go play a game. So, what are our daily uh, 2x games? I do want to see. Doubloon Disaster. This does not work for me. And Cootie Wars, um, nah, I think, I think I'm just gonna do Fashion Fever today, like, back in the old Advent Calendar days, I only did Fashion Fever, I'm gonna just do Fashion Fever again today, because I, I know I spent way too long talking at the beginning of this video, uh, about nonsense, so yeah, let's get it, um, Give us something good. Like, I like these pants, like this shirt, but, like, not these, okay? Well, maybe those glasses. Those glasses would have been fine. Actually, let's go with that. Um, We definitely need a hat because that hair is not it. Uh, it's been kind of cool. Does that even match? No, but that, that's fine. Um, Okay. That's, that's cool. Not really, but okay. All right, cool. We got that. And then we got to feed a pet and customize a pet. Perfect. So in order to feed a pet, let's go ahead and hit up uh, these three. See if we can get any food out of these. I've been seeing people getting like really nice paintbrushes out of this recently. But um, is that going to be me today? Nope. But hey, at least we got a chia fruit. A chia fruit? A chia? Would you say chia? Like a silent T? chia fruit right it just sounds like the pet but it just you know looks different um right i don't know okay let's also grab some jelly while we're here the cornu pepper and let's grab an omelet 
and cool. So let's go feed a pet and we can actually feed ELT through here. Um, feed. You can tell I always do this. No, I don't. And let's give him that chia fruit. Cool. He's now very hungry. And should have been enough for that. And then, all right, cool. So now we also got to customize a pet. So you know what? Maybe I will show off those, oops. I'll show off those uh, baby eyes that I got from the sale this weekend. I feel so, don't, don't look at ELT. Don't look at him. Um, he's only sad because he's hungry, okay? Don't look at all my pets. They're all sad, okay? Um, we're gonna fix the lemonade sadness by giving her this baby smiling eyes. So now she's just so happy, right? She just don't have no tears no more, okay? Look, she's better. This better. It says she's smiling, okay? She's not screaming. She's smiling. Yeah. All right, let's go back here. This should have been everything. And yes. All right. So go ahead and claim. And claim. And claim. And claim. And claim. Whoosh. And get our 20K for the day. All right. And this week's special item is a stealth paintbrush. That's right. Okay. Not another croc, sadly. Not a fairy cadote, sadly. But you know what? I'm going to take this stealth paintbrush. I will take it. It's mine. Thank you. All right. So hopefully we can get something cool next week as well. Um, you know I'm going to be resetting that for forever and hope that I get something cool again. Uh, this time I only had to re reset one day, maybe, at all, if I had to re I don't even think I reset. I think I just went from, uh, the croc. Was it a croc that I got last week, or was it something else? I could have sworn. I think it was a croc. Um, and then I got immediately the stealth paintbrush right after that. All right. So, now that we got that, we're gonna go ahead and go straight to Jelly Neo and get Apple Bobbing, Anchor Management, and Bank Interest right out of the way. Um, stupid Bart poison ELT earlier this week, and luckily I don't think got that going on today. Thank you. And oh, a 50 do a blue coin. Okay, I'll take it. It's not a Drake morphing potion, but I'll take it. Um, got some MP. My bank balance is growing. Yes, I love to see it. Um, not spending money like I used to. And it's going to go up a lot more now that I don't have to buy a bunch of paintbrushes. Uh-huh. Um, okay. Let's go to Forgotten Shore. Nothing. Bummer. All right. Let's go Grave Danger. And Sharky brought us a flask of liquid light. All right. All right. Let's go ahead and send him out again. Yes, send him. All right. And then we're going to go see the grumpy old king. Tell him our joke. Okay. And then uh, we're going to go hit up the rich slorg and egg. 50 points. Thank you, rich slorg. We're going to go ahead and see if the uh, Kazla Expelliarmus. You know, I wanted to say Expelliarmus. I always want to say Expelliarmus. And I still said it. Boom. Nothing. Lame. All right. Oh, what do we got here? Okay, um, let's see. So that tells us a bit of what we need to know, right? Uh, okay. 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 Yes. And okay. And then, and, okay. So the only one that we're missing is the red tomato. I love days like this. Beautiful. The only thing that would have made that better is if it gave us an icy neg. Yeah. But no, we didn't get one. That's fine. I'll take it just because it was easy. 
Um, okay, today he gave us 338 new points. Okay, thank you. Um, mushy peas. Yeah, it's the only kind of peas we're getting this season. Okay, nothing here from the wise old king either. Let's check out the fairgrounds and see if we can get something nice. Uh, something nice. Let's see here. Got a worm and a bone. And, uh, oh, yeah, we got a free lottery ticket, though. We're not going to win anything from the scratch card, though. Nothing. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We'll go ahead and play some Coconut Shy, Fairy Caverns, Berry Treasure, Lever Doom, all these things. All these fun things. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw some coconuts. Ooh. And, ooh. And, oh, oh my, I missed, oh, I missed again, oh my goodness, and I missed one more time, oh jeez, there we go, yes, keep hitting them coconuts, because I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts, deedly dee, there they are, uh, standing in a row, Big ones, small ones, some as big as your head. Oh my gosh. Has anyone ever actually knocked one down? Like, I've never seen that in my life. Like, I'll take the 300 Neo points for jiggling the, the coconuts. Um, But, like, has anyone ever actually knocked one of these fools down? All right, that's enough coconuts. Thank you. And let's go ahead into the fairy caverns and see if we can get to that fairy treasure. Oh, nothing. All right, fine. Fine. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can find buried treasure. And let's check it here. Nothing. That's fine. Pull the lever. And he steals 100 new points. What a shocker. I've never seen that before. I'm just kidding. He does that every day. Oh my gosh. Okay. How useless are we today? And useless. Just as we suspected. Okay. Um let's see. Let's go ahead and do the fairy quests for the day. Oh my gosh, what's wrong with me? I haven't even checked my portfolio and um I also want to check food club. Let's Let's see if we won anything yesterday. I have not checked. Uh, okay, my portfolio. Anything at 15? Yes, power is at 15, and I only have 1,000. Let's get more, babe. Thank you. All right, let's see. Did we win anything? Okay. It's not super big, but we won 145,000. Thank you, JK Rolling Down. I always win with JK Rolling Down. Um. Oh, what am I doing? Oh my goodness. Um Yeah, I always win with JK rolling down. I've tried a few other people, but I just haven't had as much luck. But you know, everybody's got, you know, their different looks. So let's see. Open up the shop wizard here so that we got that prepped up and accept our fairy quest for the day. Oh, could it be? Could it possibly be? I'm not going to get my hopes up. Even though it's called a hope so. Op so. Let's see if we can get one cheaper than 11999. Ooh, 6k. Okay, I'll take it. I'm not even going to keep checking. I know they're kind of expensive because Gray Fairy. Has a potential to be a good fairy. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm going to close you out. And then I'm going to open you again this way. Oh my god. My fingers are crossed. My toes are crossed. My eyes are crossed. And for gift, the tide's ELT's defense. Okay. Thank you. It's only been like six fairy... No, like ten fairy, t fairy cookies. And I haven't gotten 
Brown Fairy Quest. Oh my gosh. It's fine. I'm fine. Everything is fine. Um, now let's go ahead and hit up the lab ray for the pet pets first. Um, Frankie is now known as Lemon Drop. Okay. And then we're going to go ahead and zap Ben Jenny, who has been stuck as a green flotsam now for a week or so. And he doesn't change at all. Still stuck. All right, fine. Whatever. Uh, maybe I'll use that new, um, whatchamacallit, uh, rainbow Aisha morphing potion on him. Just so he's not a Tuscanini. I have a Tuscanini, and I'm like, why do I have a Tuscanini uh, on one of my sides? You know, I saw, like, the, uh, what you call it, the, uh, what was it, not Brucey B, little Timmy or whatever, his, like, punk here, and I was like, I want that, but I don't have a Tuscanini, so I adopted a Tuscanini from the pound with an okay name, and, uh, you know, ooh, Nurk Mid, yes. And I put the custom on him, and I haven't done anything with him since. So I transferred him to my side, and he's still wearing that custom. So. Let's see if uh, Jetsum Ace will be nice to us today. I mean, he's already given us one Nurk Mid. Maybe he'll give us two more and some red code stones. That would be nice. He gave me an EO yesterday, too, which I was very thankful for. Um, I'm definitely close to my Nurk Mid run. I will have to count my Nurk Mids and see where we're at there. Okay. All this starry food. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Z code stone. That's not bad. I will take all the tan code stones and hoard them away. I'm not selling a single one of them because I still got to train my boy Ilti. Like, he's decent. Like, his health is at 100 now. And I know, I think he's like almost level 80. No, he's like almost level 70, I think. And, you know, his stats are decent. So, they could be better, though. Trying to max him out. Whatever that means. Whatever that means. Like, I mean, I feel like I probably could be taking Jetsum Ace on at a higher level and still one-shot him at this point now, probably. Ooh, another Nurk Mid. Yes! I definitely see a Nurk Mid run in our future. Maybe I'll do something fun with it. Other than just, obviously, gambling Nurk Mids. Because, I mean, of course that's fun. But, ooh, and a Red Coast Zone. Yes, Jets Amaze. Yes! Super nice to us today. Thank you. We need that kind of appreciation in our lives. And a blue Neocola token. Okay. I'll have to check what our Neocola token situation is, too. I don't know if I'm going to do a Neocola run or not. I don't know. Can you get, like, pet pet paintbrushes or something out of there? Something. I'll have to look up what the drop rates are <laughs> for the Neocola machines. Or not drop rates, but just, you know, in general, what the prize pool is. Alright. Some junk. I feel like we're close, though. Okay, and that was it. So I know I already have a bunch of junk in my inventory, so we're going to ignore that. Fact, and we're going to look at all the cool stuff that we got from Jetsam Ace right now. Okay. 
Um, so starting, where is it? Oh, no. uh -huh. Um, here, I think, yeah, mushy peas. So we got, um, some air, some bottled fairies. We got a Zay code stone. We got a red Neocola token, a blue Neocola token, a Kui code stone, and two Nerf mids. Jensen Mace was very nice to us today. Thank you. Um, all right, cool. So... Am I missing anything? I know I always, like, say this every time I'm done, and I'm like, I always feel like there's something I missed. And I feel like I will always forget the, you know, feel like there's something I missed. Um, I don't do the fishing vortex, um, on camera, because it's just really tedious, and I never get anything good out of it, so that's that um everything out of here um we've done the laboratories and the healing springs and the academies um and yeah so let's go check out our neopets and we're gonna say goodbye yeah so um i do want to thank you for staying with me if you've watched this long i appreciate you being here um i genuinely just i know it's all gushy and mushy and stuff but i do genuinely appreciate everybody who um comes and watches my videos and spends time with me and leaves comments and i you know it it, it gets me excited it makes me you know want to do this more and, um, you know, just to know that I'm not alone doing Neopets, <laughs> which I mean, I know I'm not, but like, sometimes I'm just like, sometimes I feel like I'm the only person in the world, um, spending real money on Neopets and still playing Neopets. Uh, so I just, uh, yeah, I appreciate you hanging out with me today. Um, I'd love to know what your feelings are on the new NCUCs coming up and, um, you know, if there's anybody that you plan on getting. So thank you so much. I know I've said that like 30 times already, but I, I truly mean it. Um, well, you have a wonderful day and I hope to see you soon. Bye.